<laughs> it is a hot, hot place. Temps are about 115. Not yet, it's like 7.45 in the morning. But it's gonna be hot. It's gonna be royal. Better lather up. I got a ride picking us up here. I just do everything through bookings.com. It's pretty simple, it's pretty cheap. I bid you right up at the, uh, the arrival gates. Oh, you got it. Two. Terrified right now. Hey, reservation? Living. It's gonna be fun. Just getting some breakfast in here at Catadool. Showed up about a half hour ago. We we're pretty early. I think our check ins at like two. We showed up at eight. So we're gonna get a quick breakfast. Let's check out our room. We got some, uh, we got a nice little omelet. What do they keep calling this bread? Mm -hmm. I don't know either, but we have it at every place we go to. Some fried eggplant. I think that's feta cheese. We have cucumber, tomatoes, and beans. Let's dig in, then I'll show you around this place right on the Nile. It's all colorful, vibrant. She's in a great mood now. separate beds. This is pretty, this is pretty cool. Dome style ceiling is nice. We came early so we're just in this one for a little bit until uh, till the next one. Oh, I can't let her see any bugs on anything or she will flip out. What do you think? Like it or no? Well, it's different? Yeah. You gotta admit it is cool. Different, unique. Yeah, I don't, I mean, I'm not, bitch, I get where we are and I get it. I just. Oh, now you're taking pictures. Shut up before I do something. Get out of my picture. This is pretty cool. I just had a little rest. Took like a two hour nap, three hour nap. Which yeah, we needed, it. We needed it. We needed it because he was having a We need a little boat trip though. Go check out a botanical garden, a beach. And then we should have a guide up here somewhere. One for you. One for me. Somewhere down here. Oh, stroll. Probably already left us because we took too long. Unless that's him up there praying. Hmm. This is a big, nice, cool boat right here. Did 
This is my wife, Tessie. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. Step up first. garden I had like a bunch of trees and bushes and flowers and stuff this is from all over the world I guess little signs from different countries it was kind of cool just a little stroll and uh it's pretty different it's in like a little market got some uh a couple of souvenirs little pyramid souvenirs and bracelets for the kids and I think we're just gonna go and check out a beach up here get in the water because we need it it's hot Check out the beach, relax, get burnt. Wonder how far you can swim if it's deep. If there's any gators that will get us. <laughs> Crocodiles. Anything else you need to say? <laughs> oh man, we're stuck. I ain't going nowhere. It's crazy how the rivers is full of all these rocks. Like how they got here one time. I don't see uh, too many animals though. I've seen a couple cows or buffaloes, I guess they, they call them. Some birds, nothing too spectacular. I suppose it might just be too hot for a lot of animals. Maybe. It's too hot for me. Yeah. Roast, I'm roasting that baby in there. I don't know where the beach is at though. I think it's up there. Need this water. Is it warm or cold? Oh, dang, oh, that is cold. It's actually really cold to where I figured it was going to be. It has to be hot as shit. I don't know. about to go behind that rock here in a minute. Hell. Oh my god. I gotta, I gotta toughen up a little bit. I'm scared. I'm scared of the cold. Right. I gotta quit being a first First dip in the Nile. He did it. Can you zoom in on this thing? I don't know.
on a bunch of stuff up there too. Does FaceTime take my data? Yeah, I think so. Right. She gave in and bought the Verizon thing for the global travel, which actually is pretty cheap. It's like 10 bucks a day. I didn't really need it. I just like being off the grid. That's pretty cool. A little dip in the cold water. Those kids just kept making us do pictures of them. Trying to take pictures of us. Had to add one on Instagram. I'll have to send it to him and tag him in the video. Just so we can show all of his friends. Give me some more subscribers from the Nubian Village. Actually, who knows? They probably don't have any YouTube down here. I was going to ask them, but I feel like they don't really know anything like that. Uh -uh. Instagram. Instagram. Yeah. That came on show you around this place real quick it's pretty cool everybody's got their own little private uh little room little villa whoa big old bee on me but everybody's got like their little private villa and it seems like there's only a few people staying here like two or three somebody was seen at the airport coming from cairo and now you got this little balcony edge looking off on the nile you got their own boats there's like Felucas, which is like a sailboat, kind of like this out here. But then they have these ones, which I think it's like, a, what's the word? Darabaya, I think, Darabaya boat. It's a little faster, kind of have a, a roof on it. You can go hang out and chill, lay out. But no, this is really cool. Got some rooms up top up there. Tessie was not feeling this place when we got here. She was hoping for something more luxurious, but I tell her, you gotta, you gotta mix it up a bit. This is the stuff that I like to do. <laughs> get it get experience the real feel the Nubian village feel and now I just like to switch it up nice places little places like this this is cool though I love how it's all painted colorful all the dome rooms dome rooftops I'll take you in our screen in a second but then you got a little sandy spot right here a little spot over here to chill and they have a like a little restaurant area right there and they have this big opalix opal I can't even say the word opalisk in the middle. No, that was fun. Cool to see like a little local beach too. We're gonna uh, get cleaned up in about an hour. We're gonna go get a nice dinner at the Cataract Hotel, which we we're gonna stay at, but it was pretty expensive. And I don't wanna do that. Oh, yeah. Get cleaned up. Now it comes out here into a little deck. Yeah. private balcony of the Nile. This is royal. I put my phone in there because... In the fridge? Yeah, it's overheated. It's not... Yeah, it's so hot, your phone basically just overheats just from the air, not even being in the sun. Getting a nice dinner here at the old Cataract Hotel. She's got a little salmon steak. It's delicious. I got some marinated chicken breast, some rice. This is pretty fancy. We took the little boat up here from Cat Duel just to we were get a nice dinner in. Just we're not staying at the place like the one I really think we are, but <laughs> I think we might come up tomorrow too and swim in the pool. I think you can pay like 10 bucks and just come up, use the restaurants, the pool. Relax in this nice ancient hotel. Good food. Let's dig in. Oh, that's a pretty good dinner. What'd you think of it? That was good. Delicious. Getting a ride back home. Everybody getting in the night right here. Day three in Egypt. Just going to bed here in Ka not even Ka Aswan. We're in Aswan today. It's been moving so quick. Getting up early, flying, driving. 
Just gonna forget what day it is and where I'm at. But tomorrow we're gonna head out to uh, Abu Simbel, 3.30 a.m. About 4 a.m. actually is a pickup. And we're gonna meet like a group of people go down there with us. It's like a tour we booked here through Kata Duel. Pretty cheap, it's like 40 bucks, which I think is a good deal for a three hour drive there, three hours back, a couple hours at the, um, at the temples. It's like an eight or nine hour deal for 40 bucks, can't beat that. Had a good dinner at the Cataract Hotel. Really nice place. Kind of wish we would have stayed there, but this is also really cool. Different experience. Colorful, you know, Nubian vibes. Pretty royal. But all right, thanks for following me. Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you in the next one. Later.